That's me. What's up everybody? If you're new here, my name is Serena and welcome back to my channel. Get it? My name is Serena, hence the intro. That's so. Rena, corny I know, but that's just how we are here. In today's video, I'm doing the assumptions video about me, tag, whatever you want to call it. Um, so if you don't follow me on Instagram, here is my Instagram and you're late. <laughs> so follow me on here. I do this. Uh, sometimes I'll ask you guys what you want to see and all this other stuff. I engage with all of my followers so whatever you want or if you need to reach me for anything collabs anything then you could just you know hit me up and i know you're looking at my shirt like where is this shirt from that's dope it is dope it's a black owned business um and i will put the name on the screen here um it's not really nothing i can pronounce but this is their instagram right here so be sure to check them out i ordered the shirts on what's today i ordered the shirt on wednesday i got it on friday so so I took a screenshot, I put up three posts and one said, what was your assumption of me? What uh, was your first impression of me? And what do you like about me? So basically I'm just gonna be addressing all of those. I don't know what this is in my pillows, like black thread. I don't know. But anyways, I'll be addressing those and responding to those things in this video. So if you wanna continue, learn some stuff about me, then keep on watching okay so this first one is what did you assume about me someone said didn't really have none um uh, someone just put a bunch of emojis a smiley face a money face a uh, hearts wave and a i don't know how to respond to that but hey <laughs> um Someone said they assume that I'm very sweet. Someone else said that you are the sweetest person. Now, see this can go both ways because I feel like I'm a sweet person, but I also know I can be sour at times only because like I hold things in for a long time. And if you rub me the wrong way or I just feel some type of way about your energy, then if I don't cut you off, I am gonna snap on you. Like. I'm a Libra so it takes me a while because I try to reason why are you acting this way why do I feel this way towards you and boom I'm not sweet anymore I'm sour <laughs> also I do a lot for people if you ask any of my friends I'll go above and beyond for them y'all have seen hold on my boyfriend's calling me hello hello hey can I throw this in the box? you could if you would like to baby I would hate for you to stand in line if you could drop it there. Just ask somebody else. Sorry, y'all. My boyfriend is dropping y'all packages off at the post office for me. Uh, if you don't know what packages I'm talking about, my business information will be down below. Yeah, not what the video is about, but <laughs> since y'all are probably wondering, like, what was that about? So, yeah, I have the biggest heart. I'll do whatever for anyone who will do whatever for me. I will support my friends to the end. I just love my friends okay so if you're a friend of mine you already know how I am so yeah all right so somebody else said they assume that I'm a very shy person um I'm not really shy per se because I read the room first so when you first meet me if we're in a group I'm gonna read the room first I'm gonna try to fill you out stuff like that and then um I'll know how to you know act around you <laughs> you know some people can't handle a strong personality so i have to know whether or not how you're going to react to something already and then i will get comfortable around you if that makes sense okay my boyfriend said that his first impression of me was that i'm bougie as fuck Well, obviously now he knows it's not true but back then he thought I was bougie as fuck let me tell you something my dad raised us as I've said before on this channel um, and he is very very well off okay so when people see me they thought I was you know sadiddy oh I come from a rich house and you know I always have the lavish stuff well no <laughs> um, my dad is very well off but there was a period of time my mom had us and she's not very much well off and i've literally done with nothing like i've literally ate um uh, spaghetti noodles and canned tomatoes as dinner before 
okay so i know what it feels like to not have nothing i know what it feels like to work to have something since the time i was 16 i've been working so the fact that um people assume i'm bougie is very weird or they think that i am i think that i think i'm too good for something that's not true like literally i've had nothing and i have worked for everything that i've had i put in the effort to learn stuff so if that's your impression of me i'm sorry because it's not how i am <laughs> um yeah i'm very down to earth so yeah that's a little bit of background for y'all um someone said you don't believe in yourself you doubt yourself too much So when I first started my company, I'm going to be honest, I did not think that what I'm making now with my business, that I would be making that so soon, you know? So every time I get an order, I'm surprised. <laughs> Let's just get that out the way. Every time I get a ching noise that someone ordered lashes from me, like my heart is like, oh my God, oh my God, don't let them down, you know? Um... Support never goes unnoticed. It never is taken for granted. I don't see what's funny with this one is that I believe my capabilities. It's just that um, when the doubt part comes into play, I just doubt other people's support. If that makes sense, like people say all the time, oh, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. I can't wait for you to do this and that. But then when you do it, they're not there you see what i'm saying so if if there was any doubt it would be in the people that are like constantly in my ear you know like it sounds good but what do your actions show you see what i'm saying so if it came to i don't believe in myself and you doubt yourself too much i don't think that that's true about myself i'm just a i'm just very much a realist and that's because that's how my dad is and that's how he raised us so i look at every situation like in realistic form like if this doesn't go this way you're gonna have to do this if sales are not doing good here you're gonna have to have this sale if you need to push this item more because you have more of these in stock you're gonna have to promote it this way stuff like that that's what i am that's how I'm like. I'm going to be a hustler because that's just how I am. But um, I think I believe in myself because I never want to go back from where I came from. I'll never forget where I came from, but that just pushes me to go harder, if that makes sense. I hope that made sense because that was very deep. <laughs> um, okay. Favorite thing about you? One, two, three, four. Four people said your smile, which is so sweet, guys, because I literally do not like my smile and I'm going to pay for it to get fixed. You guys probably can't tell based off of the videos, but my teeth are very, very um, crooked. So I'm going to eventually get braces. So eventually you guys will see me with my glasses and braces because I don't wear contacts. Like even filming this right now, I can't see. <laughs> but yeah, somebody said your personality and your laugh. Laugh my ass off. Someone said, you're one of my bestest friends and you are always there no matter what. Oh, that was Jasmine. Hey, Jazz. <laughs> oh, see what I'm saying about my friends? Like they work, they get me worked up. They get me worked up. They know I'm sensitive. <laughs> um, someone said, your personality, you're very down to earth and have a big heart. Someone else said, everything, you are a strong black woman. You understand? You understand? My, someone else said, my favorite thing about you is you are a hustler. Period. You gotta get, you gotta, if, it, if it's not about money or happiness or food, I don't want to hear it. Okay? Period. If it, especially if it's not about pasta. If, if there's pasta at the venue, I'm going to go. Just saying that. Just to let you know if you were interested in what would get me out my house. If it has nothing to do with money. If you tell me there's going to be pasta there, I'll be there. <laughs> right now, but okay. Um, yeah, my, and my boyfriend said your personality and your smile. 
so yeah guys that's pretty much it let me see did i miss anything did i miss anything it seems up as hell you're sweet to go get her um you look oh someone else said i look pure i don't know about pure honey okay i got a nice heart but i don't know about pure <laughs> so yeah so that is the end of the video hopefully you learned something new about me if not i have done other um you know get to know me's and new youtuber tags you might learn some fun facts over there about my background and about me just in general if you want a more understanding of who i am i will link those videos over here on the side but yeah until next time love you guys bye